Do you own one of these? Yes, it's National Ugly Sweater Day, and chances are you've been invited to a holiday party where an ugly Christmas sweater is a must or at least an option. But what makes it ugly? Well, I can tell you. NBC4 is going to Tokumatsu was in Burbank, where there are plenty of stores for people to shop for that perfect sweater. <laughs> Truthfully, we didn't quite believe Carmen O'Leary when she told us why she was at Catnip Coalition Vintage Clothing today. Uh, you have several? Yes. <laughs> then she showed us photos of her family. Some of the ugliest Christmas sweaters money can buy right there. Her siblings and cousins even make their own. Because it's fun and like weird and I think the most odd ones <laughs> are standouts. You can uh, <laughs> make yourself look like a gift from Santa. This Drew Gid says true. the rush is on right now. This weekend is when many office parties and family gatherings are coming up. Some even have ugly Christmas sweater themes now. And everybody kind of competes with each other. Who's got the ugliest one? And this year, the bar is very high or low, depending on how you look at it. Just Google the term. The ugly Christmas sweater craze has made its way to the major retail chains, some of which devote entire sections of their stores to these hideous holiday garments. So the uglier, the better. We stopped at Yes Baby for Corey Jacobs historical take he says the sweaters first started unironically appearing in the 1980s and 90s people bought them then because well they were sort of fashionable and then like maybe 10 20 years later people started reflecting on it like wow those are kind of ugly throw in social media where you can post pictures of the ugliest of the ugly on you and voila a stocking sewn onto a sweater why not so you can walk around and you know put snacks in there or people can tip you the most important feature you should look for when shopping for one of these well carmen found it right away yeah honestly i like this one yeah i think i'm gonna get it okay great <laughs> Get some attention for sure, but make sure it brings laughter and smiles as well. Now, strictly speaking, this is not a sweater, but it does have a Christmas theme and it is ugly. The best thing about this craze is that you make the rules as long as what you're wearing is absolutely hideous. In Burbank, Gordon Tokumatsu, NBC 40.